Hello everyone, in this video we will give you the EB news of the last one week. Now we have 6 curated news for you starting with Aether. Now Aether is on a roll after launching their generation 3 450X and 450 plus they have been able to increase their sales by 4 times and Aether is not going to stop. They are doing a fundraising event in which they are aiming to raise around 200 to 250 million US dollars and we are quite sure that given Aether's reputation investors will be queuing up for that. Now whether Aether decides to hit the stock market with their IPO is something that is is not cleared yet once we have more information on that we'll definitely let you know in this channel besides that the 200 to 250 million dollars that ether is aiming to raise will help them increase their production to 10,000 units per month they're also investing on R&D because of the new model the cheaper ether that is expected to be launched next year other than that they're expanding their presence across the country right now they are available in 38 cities and they have 49 showrooms Next year, March 2023, they are expecting to be present in 100 cities with 150 showrooms. Now the second news is about Hop Electric. They obviously launched their model called OXO and OXO X at the price of 1.25 lakhs and 1.4 lakhs respectively. Now both these models they come with a 3.75 kilowatt hour battery pack that is able to generate 150 kilometers of range out of it. Now that is of course the ARAI range. The real range would be somewhere around 100 to 120 kilometers. The battery charges with a 5 ampere charger that will be bundled along with the motorcycle and it will be able to charge your battery to full in 5 hours. Now the OXO models were launched in Delhi but the company is planning to have 100 showrooms across the country and they are also selling it via online model. It is available in 4 colors red, green, blue and black and the battery warranty is of 4 years. Now mind you the motorcycle can do a top speed of 95 km per hour owing to the 3 kilowatt motor that it has and the base model can generate a peak power of 5.2 kilowatt and the top model can generate a power of 6.3 kilowatt. Now Hop Electric has already acquired 60 acres of land in Rajasthan where they are setting up their EV park so that they are able to produce 5 lakh motorcycles every year. Now moving to the third news is from Chennai's Murugappa group. Now this is a large group that has 9 companies which are listed in stock market. Now our interest lies in the TI Clean Mobility company that they have launched which is a subsidiary and will be working on electric vehicle launches. Now for now they have launched an electric auto which they are calling Montra. This 3 wheeler is priced at 3 lakh rupees because it has a 10 kilowatt hour lithium ion battery pack which the company claims can do a range of 197 kilometers but the real range should be somewhere around 150 kilometers. It is able to generate a torque of 60 Newton meters and the top speed is at 55 km per hour. Now the fourth news is from Tata Nexon EV which recently launched its jet edition starting at 17.5 lakh rupees. It is available in brown color that the company is calling to be earthy brown. It has a dual tone roof which the company is claiming is a platinum silver roof. It will be available in two models prime and max. For prime the range is 312 kilometers and for max it is 437 kilometers. Besides the new color the car also gets a luxurious and premium interiors. And the fifth news is from Chinese company BYD which will be launching Ecto 3 an electric SUV in the price segment of 25 to 35 lakhs in the month of October, October 11 to be precise. So be sure to subscribe to this channel. Go green, go electric.